Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I'm going to be planning for February 21st to the 27th. Um, so I'm still in my personal size uh, ring planner and I absolutely love how it's turning out. Um, the whole setup is a lot easier for me to work with now because I actually rearranged a bunch of the sections. So I have the more important ones in the front and then it by doing that, it leaves me with my dailies more towards the middle, I guess, middle-ish, so that when I'm writing on this side, I'm not really bumping into the rings because you can almost see that on this side, it's almost level which is perfect because this side, it doesn't really affect me much since I'm right-handed. I just start from here and go on to the edge. This was the side that was affecting me so much more. And the fact that it's now almost even with the rings, it's making it like a hundred times more doable for me. So what I'm gonna do, first I'm gonna show you what um, this week is looking like so far. So today is Sunday. So a lot of these things haven't been uh, transferred over yet. I haven't filled in a couple of these I'm gonna have to mark off my stuff. So this was my weekly. So I did, I have to mark, put um, yesterday's dinner down, but I have a couple things filled in for uh, this upcoming week that I need to remember. I had a little bit of things to buy, um, some weekly to-dos that didn't need to be done on a specific day. And then I should have a new pen coming in. I did get a new, um, Sarasa Grand Pen. I got it in like a vintage green color, so I'm super excited for that to get here. Uh, it should be getting here today. But this is how the weekly turned out. Um, so I'm just gonna take this tab off. Actually, I'm gonna leave it because it's still currently this week. And then these are how my dailies were working out. So here. So it's more like a bullet journal method, a couple um, tasks that still need to be taken off. I have a couple notes. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep it as a bullet journal method and as things get, you know, done during the day where let's say I wanna jot down a quick note, then I'll kind of put like that rapid logging note in there so that when I go back to journal, I can, I have something to journal or reference back to. So I'm going to take out my pages here. Oops. So I have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then Saturday and Sunday. And then I do need to get my, actually I'm not gonna close the rings. I need to get my weekly out, it's behind my monthly. I also need to check off my days, kind of fell off track with that. So I'm gonna put one this time going this way. that back so I'm gonna kind of use like a hodgepodge of um, of stickers so I'm gonna mix some of the kit that I had from last week because there's still like a couple like quarter boxes um, and icons that I can use just because the colors are beautiful and then I'm gonna mix from like two weeks ago my self-care kit from the style planner so I'm just gonna go ahead and open up to my monthly and put this off to the side over here so I can still see it, but I don't necessarily need it in front of me right now. My desk is a mess. I don't know where all this dust is coming from. Um, okay. So first off, let me go ahead and get my weekly header. Where are you weekly header? Hey, where are they? So these are my weekly headers that I got from River Street Stickers and it's perfect because it's Monday start and they're just nice. Ooh, I made a lot more noise than I needed it to. Okay, and I'm just gonna kind of line it up here. Um, so on the back, what I was doing, what I did last week, I was putting um, boxes here that would deal with my trackers and um, like my steps. So there's two main things that I want to track with my weekly. 
and that is my vitamins and journaling because I do want to be able to be journaling um, every day or at least one day a week where I kind of like mass journal. So I may actually not put it as journaling this time. I may put it as the workout one. I'm actually trying something that the planning mama does and I'm going to try to work out every other day so it's a little less stressful on me to get it done and it would make it a little bit more feasible for me. Um, so let's go ahead and use this pretty blue one. So I'm gonna use this to kind of mark off my steps. So I'm just gonna put this here, it's gonna represent all the days because there's seven hearts on here. And then I'll just put the steps right next to it. So let me fill those in, those steps, and then vitamins and workout because I don't want to track it to where if I'm journaling that one time a day like that one mass day a week I don't want to make it seem like I only journaled the one day but it's for all the days so then this will go and then it'll start the week just like this so I pretty much just leave this as it is um, I'm gonna work on our Black History Month project. My daughter has a, a project um, and she's really excited about it. She got Jackie Robinson. So she's excited to work with it. I think it's her first like actual project for like third grade. So yeah, okay. So then these are pretty much the stickers that I pulled to use for the week. But what I'm gonna do first is I'm going to put my, I don't know what that is. I'm gonna put my washi up at the top and then I'm gonna put my date covers down. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then we will get this going. So you guys saw me do a little bit of an uh-oh when I went to go rip off the, or like cut off the washing. It took off a piece, so it's fine. I just took it out. Maybe I'll use this as like a scrap paper or like a half paper or something like that. Um, but yeah, so this is what it looks like now. So I'm going to have to kind of come back to the planning because the baby did wake up from his nap. But I did want to go ahead and show you guys so far what it looks like and I will go ahead and add in all of the extras. So the only thing that this week won't have, it won't have full boxes this week, because um, I don't have any that'll actually go with it, but it'll have a lot of deco pieces towards the bottom. So I will see you guys in a little bit. All right, so you guys are gonna hear some banging and all that stuff because he is actually right behind me on his little play mat playing with his toys. So if you guys hear it, don't fret, it's just him having a good old time. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and add in the rest of these. These are from the Style Planner. They're kind of like her wacky and regular holidays, I guess. So I'm just gonna put them on their appropriate days. So we have President's Day tomorrow. Um, and then, woo, Margarita Day on a Taco Tuesday. And it's that two, 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 22, whatever day crazy on a Tuesday. We have tennis day on the 23rd and then the 26th is Levi Strauss day. I do not own a pair of Levi's so I can't really um, appreciate the holiday as well but yeah. Okay so now we're gonna go day by day and I'm gonna take out my little stickers here that I have pulled aside and then I also have some of these um quarter boxes that I'm gonna use, and half boxes maybe, for special things and these little icons. So everything's kind of in this little area right here. All right, so Monday, no school, and it's President's Day. I already have that sticker there, and I'm just gonna go ahead and put the no school right under the date. Um, Tuesday, my daughter can wear a tutu to school. So, um, 
Sid's tutu. She's actually excited about that because it's part. it was part of her Halloween costume. She was a ghost this past year. So she's like had no use for it since then. So she's excited to be using it. Um, and then I have a conference on Wednesday. Is it supposed to be on Wednesday? Did I put it on the wrong day? No, they're usually on Wednesdays. Okay. Um, let's see. I think I will use just a push pin. So I kind of use this hot pink one. So that's on Wednesday. And then we have Zumba. So let me put those both down. So the conference is at... Two oh five, and then Zumba is at three thirty. Um, on Thursday, a couple things going on. So there is a fire drill. So it's gonna kind of put that up here. Sid has art club. Oh. I love these little crystals from the River Street stickers. Uh, grab bag that I got. They're so pretty. So that is fire drill. Art club. And that's I don't know what time it starts. I just know I pick her up at four. Um, and then Julian also has a meet and greet with his teachers. So we get to meet all the little teachers that are taking care of him. Um, I feel like that's going to be too much for that day. I use a smaller one. So I'm going to put that just right here. And then because they're going to start letting the parents actually go to the classroom now to pick up the kids. So I'm excited about that because I usually have to kind of wait at the front gate for him. Um, and then I need a little icon. So Sid goes with her dad on Friday. So I think there was a car here. I am almost certain there was. I guess not. I really thought there was. So I'm just gonna put this one. So with her dad, which means she will not be having yoga club. So let me just go ahead and cross that out. Cause I don't know if he's going to pick her up from there or not. Um, so if she stays, she stays. If not, it's fine. And then it's also a payday on Friday. And I think I want to use a little box for it. Or at least this cute little kind of deco box here. Ooh, he's going to like fall over on his side trying to get his blocks this here and then the little piggy and put payday um and then nothing so far on saturday and then sunday you gotta go pick her up from her dad's house put this here and then I'm going to cover the little ice cream thing with the car. Let's pick up Sid. All right, so now the other things I'm going to fill in are just kind of like the usual things that I fill in, so like trash days and laundry, um, all that stuff. So let's see. Trash goes out on Tuesday. So I kind of like to 
excuse me, I kind of like to use that as like a check thing. So I put the trash out and then I put an X. Um, I also have to do my Instagram post on Tuesday, my PR post. Um, it's laundry on Wednesday. Oh, I forgot. Tomorrow we're actually going to do a Michael's trip. So let's see. I think I'll layer this one. The cute little pink one too. My daughter's been asking me to go to Michael's and my mom wants me to make shirts for her team. Oh my God, and I have something exciting to tell you guys. I think we're getting a bunny. Ah, super excited. So um, a lady I used to work with is actually selling her Norwegian dwarf bunnies. So cute. And the one that I'm looking to get is like black and white. It's a girl. I'm going to name her Carrots. <laughs> Just reminds me of Zootopia. Um, and I'm super, super, super excited because my, hu my husband actually gave me the thumbs up A-OK. -okay. So I'm like legitimately excited. Um, but yeah, I think we're getting, we're going to go look at her today um, and kind of give like the final yes no and then I gotta go get her cage and all the stuff that she needs but she's super cute and they get like only two pounds oh my god I'm like I've always wanted a bunny so now my dreams are coming through coming through through my daughter and he is forcing something out back there um so I pick up my groceries on Fridays and it's usually between 2 to 3 p.m. And then I finish up laundry on usually Sundays, but since we're going to be basically driving the whole day, I'm going to finish up laundry on Saturday and I'll do her laundry on Sunday when she gets back from her dad's so that she's all ready to go for the week. Um, I think that... On Thursday, it's the actually the same oh crap. I think it's the same time as the meet and greet. Um, she has the Black History Show. I think that's where she would be presenting her project. I don't know if it's during the day or not. Oof, I don't know. I gotta double check my calendar for that one. Okay, so last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and put some decorative pieces from like the deco pieces here from the kit. So I really like all of these self-care ones. I'm just going to kind of mix them in wherever. Um, I don't know if I wanted to put that in the corner. I got to be careful with some of these pages since this is like a thinner paper. It's a lot easier for it to kind of rip apart. I think I'm going to add this one to like the weekend. Um, so I gotta be careful where I position some of these stickers. Just when I'm turning, they kind of go with the paper. It like rips it out because it's heavier. So I'm gonna put like the cute little butterflies here together. I'm like super hungry. I'm waiting for my husband to get back from <laughs> getting food at Colada. So I'm waiting for him and finishing up planning so I have it all ready to go for this upcoming week. I don't want to be planning on a Monday again. I'd like to have it already planned out and done just out of my mind so I'm ready to just start jotting down a bunch of to-dos. Um, let's see, this is such a cute little plant. I want to mix it with a butterfly. Yes. Yes, I do. I've seen like three Amazon trucks pass by today and neither one of them have my pen. And I was super excited because the, the guy actually stopped by the house 
And I was like, my husband goes out to get the package. I was like, oh no, it's for me. And he's like, no, it's mine. I was like, God damn it. <laughs> like waiting. Um, and then I'll go ahead and use this guy here and I'll finish it up with the leaves all around. Ooh, he's back with food. All right, so let me go ahead and do a real quick flip before he interrupts. So here we have the front. This is my weekly setup. We have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And then I'll go ahead and throw in those to-dos when I start to do my planning for the week. But yeah, so if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, please hit that subscription button. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.